everybody, this is Ted Drozdowski with Premier Guitar, Summer Nam 2016, and we are visiting with our friends at Bullhead Amplification out of Nashville. Um, this is Scott, Scott Van Fossen, who builds these amps. And uh, Scott, why don't you tell us a little bit about the Matador, which you're introducing this show? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Brand new for 2016, Bullhead Amplification, bullheadamplification.com. This is uh, an incredible amplifier. It's a clean through a mid-gain amplifier. Uh, we're definitely known for the high gain stuff, and this one kind of fills in with all of the clean stuff that a lot of guys were asking for. Uh, single channel, uh, presence master, bass middle treble, and gain control with a bright switch. Um, but the interesting thing about this amp is that it has uh, uh, a selectable EQ curve on it. So the uh, bass middle treble is very dynamic, and it plays really well with that with that switching on it. Um, just as an example, here there's a mid bump, and then we have a mid scoop. So you can hear that mid really drop out. Now again, the EQ will play differently depending on the switch. And yeah, why don't you give us a taste of the EQ? And then this is the, the UK setting right here. Subtle differences, but everything is very, very usable. Um, and as far as the gain on this amplifier, um, right now we got it kind of wound out to a nice little clean thing. But if we start cranking the gain up, you can really start hearing the teeth that it has. That's actually running 6v6s in the power section. This one happens to have a 20 watt power section with 12 AX7s in the preamp. Uh, there's a serial effects loop on the back, which is what I'm running the delay and the reverb through. Um, and yeah, so right now the gain is only at what, like one o'clock or something? Oh, the, how many tubes are in there? Oh, well, we got two 6v6s and then three 12AX7s in the, in the preamp, yeah. Um, the Scorpio down on the end, that one has EL34s. I basically, since I'm a custom shop, I basically built these in a standard configuration, but if a client needs something different, I build it for him or her and make sure that they get exactly what they're looking for. You know, 6L6s, EL34s. I actually had a client with KT77s go out the door. So, um, you know, I, I definitely focus on the customer and make sure that they're getting exactly what they want. And we're super excited about the Matador. There's a lot of people asking about this amp already. So. And you've got an effects loop in there too? Yeah, it's a serial effects loop, super transparent. Um, and you could actually adjust the, the volume on it uh, if you wanted unity gain or, or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. And how did you get into building amps? Oh man, the 10 cent story. Uh, I sold an amplifier because I needed money. And uh, yeah, so I sold it and it was total seller's remorse. And uh, I literally was like, I think there has to be a way I could build these, right? I mean, seriously. And uh, that's what happened. I started building amplifiers. And actually, the circuit behind you over there is the one that I really started with. And uh, all the producers started picking up on it and word of mouth, you know? Um, so, yeah, I played some big stages with that one. That one's only, you know, 10 watts, you know, single 6L6 in the power section. And, you know, it's great. And, you know, as far as wattage is concerned, if I could talk about it for that, you know, for a second, it's like, you know, I build lower wattage stuff um, because I'm also aware as a guitar player 30 years, that playing live on big stages, everybody's tossing everything through in-ear monitors nowadays. So um, you could really wind out those power sections and get everything super gritty, even in smaller clubs and at home recording. And there's a lot of truth to that. And I think that's why all of my amps are, you know, translating so well across multiple markets. You know, rock, country, blues. Every I have a bunch of guys out on the road right now playing stuff, and they're they're like loving it. So, yeah. Well, thank you so much, Scott. Really appreciate it. Our pleasure. Our pleasure. Awesome. And for more, check out PremierGuitar.com, SummerNam 2016, y'all.